risk. A nonprofit organization established to help others during times of crisis becomes a victim to crisis itself. News Channel 9's Alyssa Sperato shows us a theft of donations caught on camera. Alyssa. Calvin and the Trisha, the Appalachian Women's Guild helps families during times of crisis in Tracy City. And tonight we learn this isn't the first time thieves targeted the AWG. To me, so incredibly sad, lame. This toy truck donated and meant for a child in need. It hurts your heart to think that people just come in and will steal from, from their own community. Instead, two thieves steal it during the night. The theft captured on this surveillance video. That mindset that would do that, I, I, I don't really... You know, if they just asked for it, we probably would have gave it to them. Yeah. That's the thing. The Appalachian Women's Guild has helped Tracy City families for the past 25 years. Its mission, providing families with important items 365 days a year, seven days a week. People lose their homes to fire. We're, the, we're here, we're, you know, you could come in and get all kinds of free things, clothes, people who need help going back to school, children's clothes, you know, women that are experiencing domestic violence, they can come in and get clothes if they can't go home. Which is why workers here find it hard to believe someone would try and intentionally harm their mission. I mean, we do so much for the community. And management says this is not the first time something like this has happened, which is reason why within the last year, they've added security cameras like these to try to help and catch the thieves. And we've probably made in the neighborhood of 60 cases and 60 arrests in the past year from this. Now this sign posted by their donation bins warns if anyone else steals, they will be prosecuted. Even though they say this is a setback, they say it won't stop them from serving their community. AWG says they still have four more surveillance cameras to install. They're still accepting donations, but now ask if you want to give that you do so during normal business hours so they can take the donations inside. Latricia. Alyssa, thank you. We have the full unedited surveillance video on our website, newschannel9.com. If you have any information on who the two people are in that video, call police.